This week on Tablet Tip Tuesday, I'm going to show you how to do proportional brushing using set actions. Currently, the view shows how much does United Kingdom contribute to the total European sales. Now, what we can do is we can click on Spain, for example, and this will update our chart. But how does that actually work? I'm going to show you how to build out the whole dashboard. So the first thing we're going to do is going to double click on country and drag sales to colour. We're going to copy the latitude field across the top and then we're going to create our first set. So if you right click country region, create set, we're just going to tick United Kingdom and just call this region. Hit OK. Region set, sorry. And then we drag that onto colour. So now we can see what's in and what's out of our set. If we hit map. Now I'm just going to create a worksheet action which applies across the data source. So again, this is a tip from Andy from a couple of weeks back. If you go to change set values, we change this to our data source. And then we change this to our region set and keep set values. So this can be our region. Let's call that region. OK, so now when I click on something else, it's just going to filter to that specific country. Now, our second part is we're going to build out our sales, subcategory sales. Hit entire view. And then we're also just going to drag subcategory sales on as well and change this to percent of total. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to add our region set to our color. And then we're going to change this compute using the region set and we're going to flip these around so that we've got our ins at the very beginning. We're going to add our labels to both of them but then in fact we're not going to add our labels to this one at all. So what we're going to do is we're going to create a calculated field that just pulls back our re selected region um, sales. So it's just going to be if region set because that's a true false so it's a boolean so if region set then bring me back the sales end so this is going to be our um, sales for the region set but what I want to do is I want to fix it across subcategory because currently if I add it in here and right click and create discrete it's going to split off those sales and we don't want that so if we right click and edit and if we wrap this in a fixed at the subcategory level for the sum of this calculation and hit OK, we then have those particular sales there and we can right click default properties, change this so that we have our sales. We can also format this. So if we format this to the colour that we've got for our in, in of our set and also to make it line up a little bit nicer. And then the final stage was if we add a reference line, we can have the total per pane, which is going to allow us to set the total uh, per subcategory. And then we want to change the computation, the, val the label to the value we don't want any tooltip and we also don't want any line. So you can see the total amount of sales for both the in and the out of the region set. And you can also see the percent of total based on the um, percent of total for that region on compared to other regions. Now, all we need to do is throw this in a, da in a dashboard. So we have sheet one next to sheet two. Now when I click France, it will update to France. And if I click Sweden, it will update to Sweden. Now back to the UK. That's all for this week. Enjoy.